I have done a lot to get my computer to run as optimally as possible. Having my memory run at 6,000 megahertz and optimal timings, and to have my graphics card, the 7900 XT, run optimally and optimized and overclocked. But this video isn't about optimizing your PC. This video is about the game we love, Plants for Zombies Garden Warfare 2. The first thing you do, right click EA and run as administrator, the EA app. Run the EA app as an administrator. You're going to need Task Manager open the whole time. Control Alt Delete Task Manager. But from ta and in Task Manager, you go to Details. You can see EA Desktop.exe. So if you right click, you see the EA Desktop.exe. If you right click that and scroll down to Set Priority, click High, Change Priority. And if you right click it again and look, it's set on High. It worked. It's on High. Now, that the desktop's on high priority, run Garden Warfare 2. Now with Garden Warfare 2 running, hit the Windows key, and you can see Task Manager again. From here, you need to find Garden Warfare 2 dot main slash uh, this one, the one with the picture of Garden Warfare 2. Now from here, if you go to Garden Warfare 2, right click it and hit set priority, it will be on normal and you can't change it. See how mine says high? So if I try to change it back to normal, this is this is the this is what you'll get if you try to change from normal to high. There's no way I've tried so many different ways. I finally figured it out, and that's why I'm making this video. You cannot change it from what it's. You can't change it to even now that I have it on high. I can't change it. Whatever it's on, which it will be normal. It's always on normal, and you cannot make it high. If you turn it, if you turn it from normal to high, it's going to say operation cannot be completed. Access is denied, and it does not let you do it. I know I didn't have to change this, but make sure the infinity is all processors to change Garden Warfare 2 CPU priority. You have to go into registry editor as an administrator in the Windows search bar type reg reg run as administrator when you see the proper logo. So from here, you want to open H key local machine. And you want to open software, Microsoft, Windows NT, not just Windows, but all the way down in W. Not Windows, Windows NT. Windows NT, current version. And then the last one is image file executable execution options. Sorry, image file execution options. So I did this now for Garden Warfare 2, and you can do the same thing for Fortnite or whatever if you find. And it works for every game pretty much. You have to make a new folder from here. You right click, image file, new key. And you copy and paste Garden Warfare 2 dot main underscore win 64 dot retail dot exe. You, you make a new key, name that exactly. I have the link in the description, the copy and paste from the link in the description. From Garden Warfare 2, you do new key again and you name it perf options, capital P, capital O, just like just like I have it. Once you've renamed the file to Garden Warfare 2 dot main dash when 64 underscore retail dot exe you right click that you right click your new folder and you make a new key again and you name it perf options with capital p capital o it'll be in the description you can just copy and paste from the description so then for perf options you right click perf options and you then you do a new d word 32 bit value this one is a 30 one 32 bit d word 32 bit then from there you name it what i already have cpu priority class that in just copy and paste from the description again. Very simple. Then you just rename it CPU Priority Class. It has to be spelled exactly right with the exact capitals. Double click that. The value will be zero. because That's normal. But we all you do is put three and hit OK. Don't change anything. You want it hexadecimal. But that's what it should be on. It should be zero hexadecimal. You want to change it to three. Then OK. And some people, you might have, I think you might have to restart your PC. Or you could check from here. It might be on high already. And if it's not on high, just restart your computer. If you go back into Task Manager, find Details, Garden for 2 Main Retail, Set Priority, and it should be on high, and you can't change it. Because now, now mine's stuck on high, and if I want to go back to normal, you're going to have to go to that folder. You, you could change it from that folder. The per, uh, from the Registry Editor, you could change... Um, from the Registry Editor, you could change the... If you don't want it high or whatever could change it to above normal normal below normal from the from the from the registry editor so this has been the biggest boost i've seen in garden warfare 2. 
I don't feel any more lags, stu stutters, slowdowns. I don't feel any lags, stutters, slowdowns. It's like very rare now. What we, what you did by changing the CPU priority to high is the computer is now focused on Modern Warfare 2. It's not, fo it's not focused on other things. Like it gives the priority, CPU priority. It gives the priority to the game, and that just makes the game run smoother. Doesn't matter how good or how bad your computer is. If your if your if your computer, if it's a potato or if it's a god tier computer, if it if it's not prioritizing the game, it's gonna it's, it's gonna lag at times. Even a god computer, if it's thinking about something else and not Garden Warfare 2, then Garden Warfare 2 is not getting the attention. This has been a huge, huge upgrade. I don't know what to call it. It's not really an upgrade. This has been a huge performance, and it's it's hidden so hard. It shouldn't be that, it shouldn't be like, see normal, change it to high, but it doesn't let you. And it drove me crazy. So, I hope this helps everyone. I really do. I hope this helps everyone. It really helped me.